Hey everyone, so today I have a craft haul for you guys from a garage sale that I went to. Um, yesterday she posted a little ad thing on, face on the Facebook and she's like a couple streets down from me and I was going to go there but she was already closed. And I'm lucky I didn't because I would have had to carry this all home. But she said she's giving, she'll give it to me half off. Um, of everything. So I'm going to show you the major thing that I really wanted uh, last. So, one second. Let me put the thing back on. So, I did get quite a bit of stuff. And I think it's worth $60 compared to what this big thing I got. So I got this Disney princess sticker one sheet. She, she said she gave me this for a dollar. It's Tinkerbell, because mom loves Tinkerbell. I got this Stampin' Up! 1993 set. Um, it's called School. They're in kind of great condition. They're in great condition. And I don't remember each individual thing that she got. But they look good to me. Except for this crayon, but the crayon's cute. I love the crayon. So, that's that. And I guess someone was like a Stampin' Up! person or a demonstrator. She said that her aunt got a bunch of stuff and then she got an illness. An illness. And she couldn't do this because of her illness. And her friend got a bunch of stuff too. And her friend died in a car accident. So she can't. She doesn't have any more room for this stuff, so she was selling a lot of it. And I got this Follow Your Dream Sentiment by Close to My Heart. This, I think, is old because it says, oh, in the, in, well, it says 25 years. And I got this because I graduated 2014 and, um, um, I graduated eighth grade, and I'm so happy to do my. I'm still gonna do my album, and I got this because I think it is really cute, and it says class of, and then there's numbers. These are photopolymer. She has some other ones, but I just didn't like like them. And then I got this Stampin' Up, Jolly Old Saint Nick. Um, I think this is kind of new, personally, but I don't know. I don't think it is, because there's no date. Um, and this is a set of six. And look, it has never, ever been used. They're all still right here. And I like these stamps better than the wood stamps. She had a lot of wood stamps, but I only got this set because I liked it, and I don't really like anything else. Then I got this mini album kit. It comes with one album, 41 stickers, four double-sided papers, and four accents. And it is in Tinkerbell. I thought this would be cute to make a little album for my mom with my niece in it. These are the four papers. I think they're really cute. Then I got... I'll show you this. Then I got this Martha Stewart Crafts. It is um, a stamp mound. I have one of these, but I don't have a block as big. Well, I'll show you the package. It's this. And it is, I think it's a good size compared to my hand. And she has the close to my heart box. I got a bunch of them for 20 bucks. And I don't really need that. all the blocks. Well, I wanted them, but I didn't get them. Then this was a good find. These are five dollars a piece. This Cricut cartridge is called Ball Decor and More. I mainly got it for like the butterfly and this princess on the front. And it has like some other princessy things. Like, it has a onesie. Those will be cute for uh, um, invitations and stuff. 
see, here's the onesie right here. Looks really cute. And then she had the Tinkerbell and Friends. Five bucks. This one has never been opened. This is open, but she said it has never been used. And got this calligraphy collection. And I like the font. And it also comes with some scenes, like it says graduation and other stuff that I really do like the font right here. Five bucks. Then I got a bunch of punches. I got a total of seven. And two of them are stamping up. She had some other stamping up ones that I just did not like them. Um, this says five dollars. She gave it for me for two. They're the hearts, and they were great. Um, I don't know how old these are, but they I like them. Then this one is like a border punch, and it is like scallops. Then these are the Marvy brand, and I don't know how much these are regular price or the Stampin' Up! ones, and she gave these to me. For two dollars as well. They don't have the sizes or anything. There's that one. This is this. I don't know what this is. This scallop circle, and these are really big. So and this oval scallop. A, another circle but this circle is way bigger than this one let me put this back on real quick and I got another bigger oval Circle. Then this container, and it has Stampin' Up ink, and they are still juicy. Um, these are retail. Well, these are obviously the. I think they're the older ones. I think they're the older ones. I'm not even sure. And it comes with some other stuff that I'll show you in a minute. These are retail $6.50 a piece. And I'm really excited to use them. This is the classic Stampin' Up! pad Tempting Turquoise. And they work really good. I just, I like these, but I'm having a hard time putting them, like, like, back. Like, I mean, like this, watch. Like, sometimes they get stuck. But I'll learn. So I got the Tempting Turquoise. And this one has another one in here as well. Still in the wrapper. So I got two. I'm going to use this one first before this one. Then I got Classics. Well, they are all classic. The Old Olive. This one's still in the package. Kiwi Kiss. More Mustard. Tangerine Tango. And this is the Stampin' Up! Pumpkin Patch. Um, I don't really like this one, but it came in there. And one of them is broken. That's alright. Okay. Don't mind. It's like one of those things where you... Like, push them together and you pull them apart. And I don't really like the when you push them together because then they all get all nasty. And I will do a part two because I only have 17 seconds left. So I will link the other video on the, the description or on the screen. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and stay tuned for part two.